What's going on, everybody? It's your boy Mike Rich, man, and this is Rich's Kicks. I hadn't done that in a while. Just thought I'd bring it back, a little throwback action for y'all. Anyway, this video is about the Master 12s, of course. Y'all thought I forgot about the own feats? Y'all thought I forgot to bring y'all that cleansed on feats? I ain't forget about y'all. Uh, I want to do a quick, just a quick review because I ain't going to the shoe that much last time. But first, I want to bring a couple of uh, pickups that I got. It's a bonus. It's a bonus on the vid, man. It's a little bonus. I went to um, back to Cumberland Mall. I didn't vlog the mall this time because I just, me and my boy T. Ward just vlogged this mall uh, last week or something like that. But um, I got a couple of pickups from the athlete's foot. The athlete's foot, man. Uh, they always, they prices always drop on their stuff first. Um, and I usually don't get, I got the, the shirt to go with these, right? The Master 12s. I usually don't get the shoe shirt. Sometimes I do. If it's a dope shirt, I get it to go with the shoe. Because I don't like to be matching, matching, matching. But if the shirt is dope, I'll go ahead and get it and rock it with the sneakers, man. But um, I cop the, this shirt right here. It actually retailed for $35. Like you said, the shoes just came out and they already dropped the price down to $19.99. So, they had my size. When it jumped on it, $20. For the Master 12 shirt. I think it's cleanse. What y'all think? Y'all y'all hit that thumbs up. Or y'all comment below if y'all think this is a cleanse shirt. Cleanse stamp of approval. In my humble opinion. Uh, let's see what's up. One more shirt I got. And I had to have this shirt. It's a long sleeve. It's the only thing I didn't like about it. But I just had to have it. This uh, shirt right here, man. Got the OG ones on it. The Chicago's and the uh, black and red joints. And it says, true OG, uh, often imitated, never duplicated. Man, that, you can't beat that. And I got that shirt for $24. And I think this retail for like $45 or something like that. So, dope. Really nothing on the back but the little Jordan, uh, the, old, the uh, for the Jordan 1, the little um, logo for the Jordan 1. So, I can wear this in my Chicago's. I can wear it with my black toes. And, you know, it's just dope. Dopeness. So, y'all... Holler at me. Uh, comment, not holler at me. Comment below if y'all like that shirt. Long sleeve, the only thing I don't like about it, the season's about to change. I don't know. I might rock it a couple of days, roll the sleeves up. I don't know. Uh, when it get cool, if I'll come back around again, I'm definitely going to be rocking that shirt. But let's go ahead and get into these Master 12s real quick, man. Real quick review, and then I'm going to show y'all the on feet. Um, you know, I ain't, I ain't even tried these on, and then I don't know how they fit. I also want to do a quick comparison um, with the taxis. Everybody... Like when they first did the um the everybody was saying a joke about taxi uh twelves and taxes twelve. I call I call these tax season twelve, but you know what? I'm I'm actually <laughs> Hey man, no offense to nobody, but I'm sick and tired of hearing people call these taxes twelve. That joke has ran its course. We can stop calling these taxes taxes twelves now. And go back to calling them master twelve, because that's what they are. Join twelve the master. But the leather quality on the taxi twelves, you can even see it when I squeeze the shoe. You can see how the um how the tumble kind of goes in. You can see it better on this side. You see how that tumble? Let me hold it long enough for the camera to focus. See how that tumble goes in like that right there? You can you can see the softness of the leather on the taxi twelves, man. This shoe released in 2012, I think. That's when I cop this. I wait in line four hours in the cold. Um in December, I think they released, and it was it was not pretty. I'm glad I got them, but boy, I would rather almost rather pay resale price than to do that. But you see, see when I do the same thing to the leather on these, it's not the same. It's 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 a tougher leather, harder leather. I hope that don't mean they are gonna be uncomfortable though, man. I had like I said, I hadn't tried them on yet. I haven't had a chance. Let's make sure y'all get a good look at those. Cause last time I think I was just moving the shoe around in my hand way too much. So uh, yep. I'm not going to call them Texas again. Uh, Master 12 action. Cleansed, in my opinion. I love the uh, gold things right here. Aglets. Eyelets. Eyelets? I think Aglets is a lace tip. I call everything hood. Lace tips. Not, you know, I just, that's the way I talk. It's, a, it's a basically the same gold. Actually, it's a, on the Masters, it's a little bit golder, like a more of a yellowish gold uh, color. I don't know if y'all can see that but anyway that, that's really it's a simple shoe all black got your white hit right there on the jump for the jump man little thing on both sides and on the back 
we got the quality inspired by the uh, greatest player ever with the white and the Jordan. Might should be they should have probably made this gold like the shirt. That would have been dope. But um, on the bottom, you got your carbon fiber, which are like almost zebra zigzag pattern. That's on all the Jordan Twelves, of course. It's yellow on the uh, taxis. And you got your white jump man instead of your red, you know, just different colors, sneaker. Um, but they cleansed, man. They cleansed, in my opinion. And, um, you know, white was 23. On the inside, and of course the tone, you got your white jump man, your white two, two, three, going down the tone. Y'all know what 12 look like. White 23 in the back, right here. Um, and it's just black with the white jump man on the inside. So, that's it. That's, that's pretty much it for the review. They made, and oh, this, this, this material right here, like this kind of like, I don't know what you call it, croc skin or whatever, but it's more, it's more kind of like, I don't know, it's different on these. It's kind of like a, I'm trying to see what the, it's blacker on the taxis. It's like blacker. This right here got some kind of gray, grayish, kind of ashy finish to it right there. I don't know. I guess that was purpose, purposeful. Different, you know, different materials, I think. This this one don't even seem like leather. But anyway, man, um, that's it on these. I think on the lace tip, yeah, it's all the same. But anyway, that's these. Quick little review. Hope y'all like my couple of t-shirt pickups I got. And I know y'all want to see these on feet. So let me finally let y'all go on ahead and check these out. On feet, man. Do it. Yes, uh, yes. Uh. The Air Jordan 12 Master, the Master on feet, man. Um, went with some khaki joggers as I always do, of course. Really love the way they look with sneakers. Uh, I always forget the fit. Let me go ahead and tell y'all the fit. They fit true to size, true to size. So go with your true size. They're a little bit um, they hug the outside walls of your feet. I got um narrow feet, so that ain't no big deal for me. They fit perfect. They actually fit better than my taxis. They're not as comfortable as the taxis because you can tell there's slight stiffness, but it's actually not that bad. They're pretty comfortable. The taxis fit a little bit better, but the taxis run a half size uh, too big. So they, when I first got those, I had to hey, I got to tie these up real tight. The taxis fit a little bit too big. These fit more true to size than the taxis, in my opinion. So I wouldn't go a size, half size up or down on these, just true to size. Um, but y'all comment below what y'all think of this release. I'm doing it in the shade first. I used to do this back in the day because there's certain details that pick up better in the shade and certain details that pick up better in the sunlight. So I'm gonna switch pants. I'm probably go with some biker denims or something. And I'm gonna go out there in the sunlight and let y'all see them in the sun too. So some walk by action. Yes, all. Oh. Man. Twins, in my humble opinion, man. Yes, all. Oh. I'm going to say the walk away action for when I put them on with some uh, them biker denim. So that's it, man. Y'all little booty. Little booty. Ass action, man. I ain't did no ass action in a minute. What was the last time I did on feet? Was it uh, the cement four? That was the last time I did on feet. Wow, it's been a minute. So um, that's it. I'm going to show y'all these with some jeans. Yeah, man. They do look it. At them with my uh, biker denim action. <laughs> My wife, she said she gonna hide these pants from me because I, I wear them too much. I don't know, I just like them. I think the main reason I like them is because uh, they tapered at the bottom, but they also uh, wide at the top. So a lot of times you have a tapered look or, or a slim look, you have, um, it's tight all the way down, but these are actually wide at the top. So they make them comfortable for me. And then they taper them at the bottom, man. So there's just a look at them. Some biker denim action. It's almost 70 degrees out here in Atlanta, man. The weather is looking great in Atlanta right now. 70 degrees. Like, I love it. I love it. Walk away, action. Yes, up, man. Yes, up. That's these on feet. Just give you a good look around here. Go in the back again. So, um, I thought a ridiculous height die down on these shoes i'll probably rock them I ain't gonna wear them no time soon i just i don't know everybody gonna have them on i'm just do this cleanse don't feet for y'all and put them back in the vault yes oh uh, that's it on these man so uh <clears throat> let's 
quick little round view. Quick little round view. Yes, sir. Oh, I see the camera. Camera caught in the shot. But um, anyway, I, I had to throw a shirt on, man. A white beater. It's actually warm enough out here for the um the tank shirt or the white beater or whatever you want to call it. But anyway, it's Bean Boy Mike Rich, man. These videos get a little long sometimes, so I hope y'all enjoyed all the content that I brought. I appreciate all my subscribers, man. We're getting close to the 100K. Hashtag 100K, man. We, we, we growing it. This is, I don't know, I just, I can't thank y'all enough for the, this just, I mean, just me doing something I love like this and y'all looking at it, y'all wanting to see it. Y'all wanting the notification squad. Shout out to the notification squad, man. I see y'all. Um, but I appreciate it, man. I got I got videos coming up this week. So I know I've been slacking a couple last couple of weeks, but I got videos coming up this week. I got some recorded already. My uh, March video. I know I'm always behind on that, but that'll be up. And I just got I got a vlogs. I got I went to a sneaker convention this past weekend. So all them videos coming up this week, man. So I appreciate y'all for watching, hanging in there with your boy, even though I don't post all the time. Hit that thumbs up, like, subscribe, and all that good stuff, and keep watching my videos because that's what I'm here for. Gone.